Or if this, maybe we should like, maybe I should call Piper. Should I call Piper? They, they did end up actually falling in love. Where are they getting this information from? Oh my goodness. See, I'm, I'm confused. Did Piper and Lev break up and am I the reason why? Everybody has been blowing up my comments. React to the Piper and Lev's breakup. React to this, that. React to did Piper and Lev break up? And y'all been asking me if I knew anything about it. So today, that is exactly what we want to be doing. It's, it's a little bit of a different setting than the actual video right now because in the original intro, there was no audio. So hello guys. Welcome, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, turn on your, you know, your post notifications so you don't miss the video when I upload. Uh, we're gonna be reacting to it, and uh, let's see. Piper and Lev broke up, I don't even know. Into the truth of my relationship, to the true truth of it. And honestly, it's embarrassing for me to think about, it's embarrassing, it's just, it's something that I really tried to Embarrassing for her to think about. I never would have thought I'd hear, hear her say her relationship is something embarrassing for her to think about. I haven't seen this video from Piper or the Anna Oop video, so I guess I'm gonna be surprised in every way, just like you guys are. Block out of my head. Basically, I'm single now, and I haven't been single in literally like four years. I've been committed to someone for almost two years. Like, I So sh wait, so they did break up. So, so wait, so they did break up. Hold on. We got we gotta figure this out. Four years! I've lost four years of my life. I'm gonna show you guys what a toxic girlfriend really is. Last night I had I had a dream that you cheated on me. Or that you cheated on me. And I'm like, you know, you you're not gonna own up to it, like don't even bother coming today. Own up to Wait, so it's a I'm so confused. Piper Cow! just dropped a bombshell on her fans after she finally opened up about how she faked her relationship with her boyfriend Lev from holding auditions to handpicking her own boyfriend from a lineup. Now everybody is questioning how deep the stage romance has gone. Like was any of it ever real at all? Loves, the tea is hot off the stove so let's find out. We're back on the couch. The tea is hot off the stove like, ah, like it's burning burning in here you know what i'm saying like i'm so confused so was their relation their relationship definitely was real because i was like i was around for it i saw it i don't think it was fake i don't know let's just watch um dude basically what i'm about to say is something that i really honestly want to take off my chest for such a long time but i have no way of navigating how to tell you guys without sounding like a total freak which is so gonna sound like a freak but you know Freaks are fine. Freaks are fun, right? So, over the- What? Last couple of months, Piper's relationship has been under intense scrutiny. From her fans to the internet at large, everybody has been wanting to know what is going on. Rumors of her breaking up with Lev and getting back with Gavin were constantly making headlines. And That's not true. That's not- Oh my gosh, y'all see that new cut? Yeah, someone- Hey, someone- Someone watch this. Make an edit out of this. Ready? I'm so sorry I got sidetracked. But that's not true. We did not get back, to, they didn't break up so we could get back to, you, you should already know that's not true. Even Harper included it in her diss track back when the two were beefing. Loves, Piper herself decided to squash those rumors when she made a video with Gavin addressing me. However, it seems like that's- I did do that. It wasn't enough. It seems like every other week a new video would pop up on YouTube and each time it would be like Piper breaks up with love with proof or Piper confirms breakup with love with proof. Y'all, these videos were everywhere and it seems like Piper was getting tired of seeing them because she decided to come out and reveal the truth about her relationship with love. But what she had to say left people a bit shocked. Piper began by saying that for the longest time she had wanted to tell the truth to her fans, but she was afraid of how she would come out. Now, some people thought she was crazy or a freak for doing what she did and as it turns out after her breakup with gavin all the that's uh that's that's a crazy clip to pull up anna just uh just letting you know anna that's uh that's a crazy crazy clip to pull up let's, let's years ago piper was really heartbroken and i mean who could blame her her breakup was so drama filled and messy especially after gavin revealed that the reason they broke up was because of tiffany piper's mom according to gavin tiffany would often hurl insults at him causing his own mother to defend him from tiffany the constant drama from tiffany caused strain on his relationship with piper and they decided to break up now considering piper was like oh my god here's a clip of me in the in a dress in a cherry dress I was like, I was like five years old. Who made me put on a dress? 11 or 12 at the time, that surely wasn't an easy thing to go through. I don't know if you remember. 
definitely wasn't an easy thing to go through when, when we did break up. At the time, YouTube couples were going viral and a heartbroken Piper had decided to bury herself in her channel and just bang out video after video after video. Now, of course, having a channel that was seriously gaining traction at the time, people would have loved to have seen Piper in a whirlwind romance and that would have guaranteed views for her channel. So, according to Piper, her management team sat her down and told her that she should get a boyfriend and try to capitalize on the content opportunity. But there was still one problem. Piper hadn't been looking for someone at the time. I assume she was still concentrating on- Where? I wonder where she's getting this information from. Maybe it'll like reveal in a little bit, but I don't know if this is true or if this- Maybe we should like- Maybe I should call Piper. Should I call Piper? Should, should I- Should I- Should I call Piper? Nah, nah, nah. We'll wait, wait, we'll wait, wait to the end of it. We'll wait. Healing after her messy breakup with Gavin and loving herself. As you guys know, my first like public relationship was very public. We broke up in a very public way. It was very nasty. Everything that happened was very, very like disturbing. And it was just, that was a very awful way to, you know, end my first ever breakup. I'm like fresh 11. Like I didn't need that stuff. Also, with our, with me and Pi me and Piper's breakup, it was like, it was kind of out of our hands. Um, you know, like the whole, the whole situation, it was just, it was, it was nasty. And like, we were really young and I wouldn't even call it like a relationship. Like, I don't, I wouldn't even consider it a relationship. We were like 12 years old, 11 years old. So like, you can't really even have a relationship. It's all in the past now. It's fine. It was a very long time ago. We live, we learn, and we grow up. At that time, we were like, you know, banging out YouTube videos. YouTube was loving us. We were getting tons of millions, gajillion views, you know what I mean, like that? And at the time, couples and like crushes, it was a really, really big thing. But it was, and we made it even bigger. Y'all don't, y'all don't give me and Piper enough credit for you know making that stuff like a little bit bigger than it was. But whatever, let's let's let the pot simmer a little bit more and boil. Have seen this predicament? Piper's management team advised her to hold auditions to get a boyfriend. That's right, auditions to become Piper Raquel's boyfriend. Like literally, that's what the casting call said. Now Piper explained. Wait, did they leak this information? How did this? Oh. The reason for this was that for a channel like hers, it requires a bit of acting and finesse to truly keep her audience engaged in the video, and they felt getting someone professional who was used to YouTube and being in front of a camera constantly would make the content feel more organic. We decided that the best way to do this, the best way to navigate this is, you know, I didn't want just some random person off the street who has no clue what, you know, YouTube is about, because YouTube is a lot of acting. There's a camera. Fair point. Like a lot of the videos that like we did back then, they were all scripted. Like honestly, it was because we 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 were, you know what I mean? Like it's hard not to script those things, especially like just the content we were making. If you if you weren't already able to tell, it was just yeah. So I didn't want to just pull a random person off the street. But that's another good point. It's like random people off the street, like just random people. Like I've tried to bring random people into like my videos before who aren't used to being on camera and you probably know what like videos or people I'm talking about and it never works out so like smart move but kind of kind of kind of weird I don't know my manager team wanted me to do this they suggested this to us they said that this would be a really good idea so that it could protect us from a lot these kids know what they're doing it will be sick anyways Piper and her team held the auditions and naturally a bunch of guys showed up they soon started going through the list of people who auditioned <laughs> There's me. Ended up with a short list of 20 suitable candidates. However, out of the 20 guys, two immediately stood out to Piper. I had an audition. I had an audition that was called Audition to be Piper Raquel's boyfriend. Yeah. And guess how many people showed up? A lot of people. And it wasn't like they saw who I was and like, damn, I need to hit with with that shawty. No. It was literally like, it was an audition. They were auditioning to be in the Piper Raquel show. We went through like a huge list of people and got that we really, really liked. And out of that 20, there was two people that we really, really liked. One of the guys was Jensen. Let me guess, I was gonna say, let me guess, Jensen and, and Lev. And the other was Lev. Piper admitted that Jensen was an amazing candidate because he was calm and collected. He had a black belt and generally had a confident demeanor about him. I assume, like, you can't be a black belt and lack confidence. Those two surely go hand in hand. Anyways, at first Piper mentioning the name said that her BFF at the time had a huge crush on Jensen. You guys, it doesn't take a genius to know that- Oh my gosh, that necklace she's wearing. What's that? That's from when we were dating. I say date. I don't know, I swear we had a- Maybe I'm just 
He's talking about Sophie. By the way, the auditions were for Piper's boyfriend, but Sophie got lucky and walked away with Jensen. <laughs> Anyways, Lev was the only one left standing, and Piper said it was Lev at first sight. Piper quickly looked Lev up and even did a bit of stalking, and she knew who her boyfriend would be. However, Lev didn't actually know who Piper was at the time, but I assume the more they started hanging out, the more he too fell for Piper. The first person he actually looked at on Instagram was Jensen. Cool kid, he like looked a lot different, he was like a freaking black belt, and we were like, oh, that is so cool. So, so basically, people were being casted to be Piper's lover, is what I'm getting out of this. And I guess the two people were Jensen. That is interesting, I guess Jensen was supposed to be like a potential candidate for her boyfriend, but ended up being with the other girl. Like, W or L take, let me know, let me know. Looking at him, we were like, all right, he's a really good candidate. My best friend at the time was like, I love him, I wanna have him as my boyfriend. And at the time, we weren't even trying to figure out a boyfriend for her, this was just a boyfriend for me. I was like, you know, then I still find it crazy she even made this video. Like, I, I'm so surprised. I saw my boyfriend left. But I wasn't the only one shocked to find out that Piper met Lev through the audition. Just take a look at these people's reactions after hearing Piper's story. Yes, I've been waiting for this because I was so confused about what's going on with you and Lev. I always truly wondered how Lev ended up in your videos. So it's really good now we know, and I'm really proud of you. I thought Piper was going to say she broke up with Lev. I was scared at the beginning, but he's in money. No, Lev, I was like, literally, I, I never believed in Uh, I mean, at least, at least like, you know, whether or not they, it was audition and like scripted, they, they did end up actually falling in love, which, which you gotta respect. You know, you gotta give a little bit of credit to that. Like they did actually end up falling for each other at the end of the day. So all power to them. The first sight until I saw him because I legitimately went onto his like Instagram and like I saw him dance and I saw his photos and I literally fell in love with him in like two seconds. I just didn't know I was in love with him. After the first time I saw him, I literally could not stop thinking about him, which is like honestly like a beautiful story <laughs> that he auditioned to be my boyfriend and like I literally fell in love with him and he had no clue who I was. Now Piper revealed that after the auditions, she worried Lev wouldn't like her back. I mean, he was 13 and she was 11 at the time. And on top of that, Sophie's mom didn't like Lev at all. Apparently, Sophie's mom didn't feel like Lev was right for the part because he was- Where are they getting this information from? Oh my goodness, my head is spinning. My head is absolutely spinning right now. Like, I did not think this information would ever get released. Like, I am, I am finding out so much right now. Not good looking enough to play the role. You guys, Sophie's mom even went as far as to look for models around LA so that they could replace Lev with a guy she felt was more good looking. Girl! I hope Lev didn't know this because it definitely would have been heartbreaking basically to be told you didn't get the job because you are ugly. Also, my ex- Nah, bro, Lev is a good looking dude. Lev's a good look. Hey, Lev, if you're watching this, you're a, you're, you're a, a look smacker. Like, all power to you for that. You can appreciate a good looking man. Was constantly saying, oh, Lev's not good looking enough for Piper. He doesn't have that look. He doesn't have that look. And I was like, what are you talking about? So, of course, my ex best friend's mother decided to go on Instagram and literally look up model boys in Los Angeles and found another guy. So at that time, I had two crushes. But the question? Lev auditions to be Piper's boyfriend, that meant that it was a job and you get paid to do jobs. So how long did he get paid to be Piper's boyfriend? And since they are still together, is he still getting paid? And what if Lev never fell for Piper? Would he continue faking it? And I mean, since the job was basically faking romance and if he didn't do a good job, he would get replaced. So did Lev fake falling for Piper? And if so, is he still faking it today? And he would- I don't think, I don't think so. Is it's natural to have all these questions. Piper's revelation just left more questions than answers. So I decided to check out Lev's page to see if he had something to say about Piper's tell-all story. That's when I found something weird. For the past like four months, Lev has always started off his video descriptions the same way. They always go something like, hey everyone, Lev Cameron, Piper Raquel's boyfriend today, blah, blah, blah. But on the same day that Piper released her video, Lev also released his music video for his song, Knew Me Better. But the caption was different. 
It read, hey everyone, love, Cameron here. It's a great day to sit back and enjoy watching my official music video to my new single, Knew Me Better. The official music video tells a great story with Piper Raquel. Now, Piper was in the music video, but she was playing the role of Lev's friend's girlfriend. This is definitely an indication that they are still together, but I just found it weird that he decided on the exact day to switch up a format that he has been using for months. Anyways, this isn't the first time Piper has yeah, I mean, but they're still together. Like they, they made a music video together. See, I'm I'm confused. I I still don't even know if they're together. Opened up about being in a fake relationship. You guys remember a couple of weeks back when Piper took to TikTok to call out her ex squad members for being fake? She wrote, happy because I'm starting my new squad with my new friends. This shocked a lot of people with fans flooding her comments to try and ask Piper to clarify her caption further, but loves, no one was truly ready for the response Piper was going to give. Loves, Piper decided to respond with one shocking answer to a fan who asked, what is it? What was the shocking answer? Her if she missed her old squad. Piper replied saying, I prefer my solo, just my squad. No drama, no toxic love triangles, no fake friends. This sent TikTok wild because no one was expecting this. As we know, ever since- Not gonna lie, I wasn't expecting that either. That was a bar. The lawsuit earlier this year, the old squad wasn't cool with each other, but no one expected Piper to be the one taking the first shot at her former friends. However, it didn't stop there. Piper continued saying, sure, no one is perfect, and I'm sure they had their problems with me, but I'm stating my own personal issues. Y'all, on top of that, Piper has been having this back and forth with Aliana over Lola. Piper's beef with her fake friends reached... Alright. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video when I upload. Also, history is coming very, 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 very soon. Actually, there might even be a pre-save link by the time this video is out, or it might not be. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Subscribe.